to your 30 minute sculpt surprise pure Pilates. All you're gonna need, this is optional by the way, Pilates ball and an adjustable band. We're gonna get started in 15 seconds. It's a straight 30 minute countdown timer. I want you starting off on all fours, okay? Finding neutral spine so your knees are directly underneath your hips. Same for your wrists and your shoulders. You're gonna do a few cat camel stretches. Just find that neutral point where you are bang it in the middle between a cat and a camel stretch. So your back is super flat. Your belly button is back towards your spine. We're gonna start off just by taking the right arm out in front of us and then slowly drawing it back down again. Breath out, left arm. Breath in, back down again. Amazing. Really taking those shoulder blades down and in. Breathing, focusing. You have two to go. Great work. Last one. Now we're gonna go with the legs. So you're gonna take your right leg out, flexing the foot, shooting it back into a straight line, then back into neutral. Now onto the left side. Amazing work, guys. Belly button back towards the spine. As always, no overarching the back. Turning on those glutes. After this, you have two left. Amazing, last one. Great work, you're now gonna keep that left leg up, straighten out the right arm, hold there for me nice and strong. Good, focus on one point in front of you. So down towards the mat and slightly in front of you. Hold it there, hold strong. Three, two, one, now crunch in and straighten out. Amazing work. Crunch in and straighten out. We're gonna go with eight of these. This is number three, keep going. The slower you go with these movements, the harder it is, the more intentional it is. Slow it down and focus. Two left. Last one, now hold it out, hold it strong and pump up for 10, 9, 8, 7, arm and leg, 4, 3, 2, hold it a little bit higher, good, now open out the arm and the leg and close it, good work, try and keep nice and stable, this is number 3 of 8, keep it going. You're nearly there. Two more. Amazing. Lower that arm down. Keep the leg up nice and strong. Tiny little pulses up we go. 10, 9, 8, 7, 4, 3, 2, and 1. Take that leg up to a 45 degree angle. Pump it up. 10, 9, Four, three, two, to finish it up, you're taking it across the body, diagonally, now pump it up there. 10, nine, eight. Think about you all the time. Four, three, two, and one. Lower the leg down, okay? A few cat camel stretches again. Swaying your body side to side. Finding where it's super tight and just honoring that. Amazing guys. From there, find neutral spine again for me. Belly button back towards the spine. This time, you're gonna go with opposite arm to leg again on the other side. So your right leg shoots out, then you're gonna take the left arm out. You're gonna meet in the middle, then shoot it back out again. Eight of these. Good, focus. Nice, strong movements. We're already halfway. Last one. Hold it out strong, hold it there. Hold it strong, flex that foot, squeeze that booty. Belly button nice and tight back towards the spine. Core engage, pump it up. 10, nine, eight, seven, 
six, five, four, three, two, and one. And from here, you're gonna hold strong. Super, super, super strong. Okay, open it out and close it. Remember, one side is always gonna be stronger than the other. That's normal. This is number three. Halfway already, four to go. Two more. Last one. Amazing, take that hand down. From there, the leg is in neutral, straight out behind you. Tiny little movements as you pump it up. 10, nine, squeeze the booty. What you don't wanna do is arch the back, okay? These are tiny little movements, really focusing on those glutes. Five, four, three, two, and one. Take it out to 45 degrees, pump it up there. 10, six, five, four, three, two, and one. Now across the body. Good work, and pump up. Eight, seven, six, five, higher. Four, three, two, and one. Take yourself back into a worship pose. Stretch, just enjoy, breathe. Amazing work, guys. Your glutes should be awake. <laughs> You should be feeling those booty muscles. Amazing work. We're now gonna go into a little bit of back before we go into our first section of core. Okay, from here, we're gonna slowly lower ourselves down to the mat with a tricep lower. So take those elbows in close to the side of the body. Slowly lower all the way down, amazing. From here, your fingertips are coming by your temples. I want you to squeeze your booty, really focus on your uh, core. Again, belly button back towards the spine. From there, your forehead is resting on the mat. Fingertips by temples, take a deep breath in. On the breath out, lift up that upper body and keep looking down. Amazing, lower down from there. And again, breath out, come up. Breath in, lower. Keep going with those movements. Now really think about your pelvic floor here. Pulling your pelvic floor up and in. Engaging those core muscles. These aren't big movements, they're small. They're focused. Three more. Two to go. Last one. Now you're gonna hold it for 10, nine, eight. Keep looking down, keep squeezing those shoulder blades. Five, four, three, two, and lower down one. Have a moment, we're gonna go in again with that same movement. Squeeze those booty muscles. Three, two, one, up we come. Hold it there. Shoot those arms out to the side, then bend them back again, then a tiny little pump up. That's one. Pump up, two. Three. You're already halfway four. Amazing. Five. This move is incredible for your posture. Six. All of this in prone lie, lying on your tummy is. Seven. Last one. Eight. Shoot those arms out. Hold them up. Nine. Eight. Seven. A little higher. Five. Four. Three, two, and lower down one. Amazing work. Have a little moment, then we go for a set of reverse hundreds, okay? Just take your head side to side, stretching out your neck. All right, shoot those arms down by the side of the body. From there, I want you to roll your shoulder blades, your shoulder blades down and in. Squeeze them like there's a sponge in between your shoulder blades and you're trying to squeeze the water out of it. Take a deep breath in, on the breath out. Squeeze the booty, now lift up. Hold. Three, keep looking down. Two, 
Now pump those arms up and down, let's go. Breath in, two, three, four, five, breath out. Two, three, four, five, breath in. Two, three, four, five, breath out. Two, three, four, five, that's 20, keep going. If you can, lift the legs up. Two, three, four, five, breath in. Two, three, four, five, breath out. Two, three, four, five, that's 40. A little bit higher if you can. Five and out, two, three, four, five, halfway. Come on guys, come higher. Squeeze those shoulder blades. Imagine I'm there with you and I am squeezing your shoulder blades together for you. Then you have to hold it there. Keep holding. Good, you have just 30 left guys. Keep pushing, keep fighting, keep going for it. Last 20. Last 10, nine, eight, seven, breath out. Good work, three, two, and one, amazing. You should be feeling that upper body, your back, a little bit of your core, your booty. Okay, from there, just have a little moment, shake those shoulders out. Then in one movement, push yourself over, downward facing dog again. Good work. Oh, breathe, you guys. Breathe, enjoy that move, moment, I should say, your movement, or both. We're now gonna go into your core section. So you're gonna need your Pilates ball, okay? From here, remember, if you don't have the Pilates ball, you can go without. This is just gonna make it a lot harder. You can grab a hold of these in the store section of the app, okay? So from here, I want you to place it underneath the lower back. We're gonna gradually get more progressive with this, harder as we go along. My ball is pretty inflated, which makes it harder. If you want to make it a bit easier, let a little bit of air out, okay? From here, double leg tabletop, nice and high in that crunch, 90 degrees at the knees and the hip. From here, we're gonna start off with a tap down, a scissor into a single leg stretch. Good, alternating sides. Good work. To make it harder, lift the head up. And if you feel you can, come onto the fingertips. If you're feeling super strong, hover. Or harder still, hands by your temples. Try not to come any further than 90 degrees with those knees. Good work. You've just got one left on each side. You can do it. Last one. Amazing, hug those knees into the chest, have a little moment. From there, we're going into some lift lowers. Good work, guys. Breathe. Ooh. Okay, double leg tabletop. From here, you are gonna straighten out your right leg. You're gonna lift and lower, let's go, 10 on each side, nine. If you can again, hover the arms, or fingertips by temples, seven, six, don't give up, five, three, three, two, and one, no break, other side, let's go. If this leg starts coming in too close, it makes it easier, keep it out, seven, Six. It's like you have a spark that leaves me burning. Three. Two. And one. Again, knees into chest. Next up is gonna be hundreds. You can do this, guys. Hundreds on or off the ball. Obviously, on the ball is a lot, lot harder, okay? Going in three. In two. Double leg tabletop. Come on up into a crunch. Let's go. Pump those arms up and down. Good work. Support the head if your neck is sore. Keep looking forward. Straighten those legs out if you want to make it harder. 45 degrees. Woo! Good work. You're nearly there. Well, that's a lie. You're nearly halfway. <laughs> All right, you're halfway. Amazing. 50 left. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Remember your breathing. Two, three, four, five, breath out. Two, three, four, five, breath in. Two, three, four, five, breath out. Two, three, four, five, thirty left. Twenty. 
for the sky and then back down and get 10 of these. Three, two, one, let's go. Reaching up and back down. Keep squeezing that ball. Two. Three, amazing work. Remember as you're lowering down, it's the lower back, then the mid back, then the upper back. It is controlled. It's not just a fling back, okay? I've lost count, I think we have about five left. Amazing, vertebrae by vertebrae, lower back, mid back, upper back, three left, two, one more, amazing, we're going to start making it a little bit harder now, stick with that same level if that was enough, otherwise as you come up you're going to straighten one leg out, okay, let's go, good work. Well done. It is controlled. It's not too fast. We're controlling the movements. Amazing. Trust me, I get it. Your full body is on fire right now. I told you it would be. Guys, if you have been picking random workouts here and there and you're so frustrated because you're not getting the results that you know you deserve, it's because you're not doing a structured science-based guide. Now, if you want to get in the best shape and mindset and transform your life, the eight-week lean transformation method combining Pilates, hit and strength all from home. Details are down there. Don't miss out. And yeah, come join us. One more. Good work. Amazing. This time you're going to come up and you're going to leave that leg in hover if you feel you can, okay? Let's go. Up we come. Hold it up. All right. Hands forward. Reach. Ten. Nine. Eight. Good work. Seven. Three. Four. Three. Two. One onto the other side, let's go. Six, five, good work. Four, three, two, and one. Both legs down, pump it up for ten, then we're done. Nine, eight, three. that you go in each time. Good work. Remember it's a circle, it's not just up and down. Keep squeezing that ball at 50% of your maximum. Good work. Last one here. All right, we have another 10. This time you squeeze 100%. Squeeze, 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 squeeze. 10. Keep squeezing. Nine, come on, really squeeze. If I see that you are not squeezing, I am coming into your living room, your gym, wherever you are, and I'm going to force you to squeeze that ball. Try and burst it. Amazing. Four left. A nice circle. Three. Keep squeezing. Two. Last one. And one. Hold it there. Squeeze that ball. Squeeze, 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 squeeze. Pump it. Ten. Nine. Then you're done. Eight. Seven, keep squeezing. Six, 100% of your maximum. Four, three, two, slowly lower down. Oh my gosh, my abs, wow, I don't know about you. Reach those arms up and over the head. Breathe, have a moment. 
We're now going to be going into a little bit of a surprise section because we're actually using the wall for this section. I should have said at the beginning, you need a wall, okay? So we're going to start off with some nice glute work on the wall. You're going to be facing towards the wall. No ball to start off with, but you are going to need your adjustable band, okay? So from here, I want you coming nice and close to the wall. I'm about, oh, I'm so bad with, I'm about two rulers away, I'd say, so like 60 centimeters, but I'm pretty tall, so you might want to come a little bit closer. Dig the heels in, okay? From there, shoulder distance apart with those feet. Segmentally roll up the spine, starting off by lifting your booty, then your lower back, then your mid back, then your upper back. Okay, hold there. Squeeze those glutes. Take those arms down by the side of the body. If your neck is sore, it means you're too close, okay? So move a little bit further away and let's go up again. Amazing. Hold there, squeeze there. Breathe there, turn on those glutes. Three, two, and one. We're just gonna go with little pulses. Amazing, keeping those knees shoulder distance apart. Squeeze the butt muscles. Keep that core nice and tight. We have 10, nine, eight, seven, six. Keep squeezing, five, four, three, Two, and one. From there, hold, hold, hold. Slow and controlled, lower down. Okay, we're gonna add the band on and it's gonna start getting nice and spicy. It's gonna get harder, okay? Taking that band just above the knees. From there, exactly the same setup. Digging the heels in, your shoulder distance apart. My band is at moderate resistance, okay? From here. Peel yourself up into that bridge position. Hold and squeeze. Keep those knees at shoulder distance apart. Turn those glutes on. If you haven't got the adjustable band, guys, again, you can get it in the shop, okay? Hold there, squeeze there, core tight. All right, we're gonna start off with pump outs. Let's go, out against the bands. Good. Really pushing out against that band. If you haven't got access to a wall right now, you can do this on the floor. Good, keep squeezing, keep pushing. Amazing. You're nearly there. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, and 1. Hold the legs wide. A little bit wider than shoulder distance apart. Now pump up. Good. Tiny little movements. Turn on those glutes. You should be feeling your hamstrings, the muscles down the back of your legs. Good. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, and 1. Amazing. From here, flatten the feet out. Raise one heel and back down again. Good. Try and keep your hips nice and stable. Amazing work, guys. Keep going. Keep squeezing those booty muscles. Good work, just four left. Last three. Last two. And one from there, lower halfway down, up. 10, nine, eight, seven, six, Five, you're nearly there. Four, keep squeezing. Three, two, and one. Slowly come down. We are gonna be going back up again, okay? This time, I really want you digging your heels in. Okay, so dig your heels into the wall. Amazing, you're gonna peel your weight up into a bridge again. In three, in two. Okay, peel your weight up into that bridge. Amazing work. All right, this gets harder. From here, I want you to try and walk your feet up and back down again. That's one. We're going to 10, two, three, 
three, nearly halfway. Four. Five. Six. Seven, I'm moving away from the wall. Just readjusting. Eight. Nine, last one. And 10, hold it out with those legs up high. High, high, high. Tiny little pump ups. Good work. Good work, guys. You got a slight bend in the knees. You have 12, 11, 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, and 1. Take those knees back into the bent position. Good work. Down, up, open, close. Butterfly bridges on a wall, that's two. You're lowering halfway down only, three, four, five, six, seven, dig those heels in, eight, two more, nine, hold it there, pump it out, ten, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one, lower down. Hug the knees into the chest, amazing work guys. You should be feeling a nice little burn, okay? We're gonna take the band off now and we're actually gonna place the ball in between our inner thighs. We're gonna continue on the wall, flat feet this time. We are gonna really squeeze that ball, okay? So the feet are gonna be a little bit narrower. From here, I want you to peel your way up into a bridge, squeeze that ball 100% of your maximum. Squeeze, 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 squeeze. Now tiny little pump ups. Good work, keep squeezing. This is the only exercise we're doing here. Good, keep squeezing. 10, nine, eight, seven, six, five. Keep squeezing, three, two, combine it. Down, up, squeeze up. Down, up, pump. Three, good, keep squeezing that ball. Four, all the way to 10. Amazing. You're nearly there. Seven. Eight, two more. Nine, keep squeezing that ball. 10, hold it at the top, squeeze the booty, squeeze the ball, pump. 10, nine, eight, and seven, and six, and five, and four, squeeze. Three, two, and one. Lower down from there, hug the knees into the chest. We are finishing up with core, you guys, okay? You can do this. You have literally three minutes left of work, that is it. You're gonna start off with the band, loosening it off a bit. This is your last section to finish off your core, okay? Loosen it off, I'm going to here. You're gonna place it around your feet to start off with, okay? We have our bicycles. You wanna keep the feet flexed. From here, rotate the elbow to the opposite knee, let's go. Really push against that band. Amazing work. Keep digging deep, keep pushing. You have 10, nine, eight, six, five, four, three, two, and one, place that band just above the knees now. Tighten it up a little bit for me. Okay, from here, we're gonna start off with your legs at 90 degrees, okay? From here, reach to the feet, push out. Good, doesn't matter if you only get here, that's fine. Three, as high as you can, four, five, nearly there, six, keep pushing. Seven, eight, nine, last one, and ten. Place those legs down, keep the knees shoulder distance apart, hover up, reaching side to side. Good work. There is absolutely no breaks during this little core section. You've got just over a minute left, okay? Good. Five, four, three, two, and one. We are ending on all fours as we started. Finishing off your core, okay? 
From here, tuck the toes under, lift the feet just an inch, okay? Step the foot out and back in again. Amazing. Keep it moving. Four, three, two, and one. Now take it forward. One, two, three, four, all the way to ten. Six, seven, four, five, eight, nine, and ten. Dip the knees down and up. Two, three, they barely touch the floor. Five, six, seven, eight, nine, and ten. Hold in a full plank. Good work, keep holding. We're gonna seesaw forward and back for 10 for last. Nine, eight, seven, then we're down. Six, five, try and get the chin in front of the hands and back. Three, two, and one. We made it! Guys, that was amazing. I really, really, really hope you enjoyed it as well. I actually thought that was really fun. It was really different. And yeah, it was kind of some new, nice, can't get my words out, some nice new moves there. Please don't forget, cool down, stretch, hydrate, have your greens if you've got them. And yeah, I'm just so proud of you guys. Well done.